The high school sports now the uh, indoor top times was this weekend in Bloomington. Uh, it's not only the indoor state finals, it's also a preview of the spring. Uh, looks like it's going to be a great spring outdoor season for Central Illinois standouts. A couple of high school rookies won state titles. Bloomington Central Catholic's freshman phenom Isaiah Whitaker not only won the state pole vault, he set a meet record clearing 16 feet 6 inches as a freshman. Oh, it's amazing doing it your freshman year. There's like no words to describe it, really. From a freshman rookie to a rare senior rookie, Metamora State basketball champ Drew Tucker is giving track a shot this spring. He won the high jump in his first ever indoor top times track meet. It's awesome. I mean, first time coming back to track and getting a win is always nice. On the girls' side, Stark County's Lindley Johnson is paved to have a senior season to remember. She won both the 200 and 400 state titles. I always like to stay humble because I don't want to get too ahead of myself, but right here just shows that I got what it takes. Tremont's reigning outdoor state champion Cambria Geyer won the 60 hurdles. Meanwhile, lots of field champions. Aubrey Phillipsville, Paso Gridley won the high jump. Laney Lester of Henry won the shot put. Eureka's Laurel Munson wins the long jump. And in Class 2A, it's Richwood's Lena Jackson winning the 60-meter sprint. An amazing performance by the Dunlap girls track team. Less than 24 hours after the death of their classmate Tessa Sutton, Dunlap athletes wore Tessa's number and purple ribbons. Dunlap's Chelsea Wetzel wins the pole vault state title. Tegan Zimmerman second in the state in the long jump. What a way to honor Tessa and Team Tessa.